Good morning guys, welcome back to CNC Life. Today, for the first time ever, we're a family of four out and about. This is our first time actually like leaving the house as all four of us. And we opted for the park. It's a little chilly out, but we all doubled up on layers. And we're feeling pretty good. Look at Iris, having her morning snooze. She's double layered mittens, beanies, socks, and a blanket. Um, I was telling Carlos, <laughs> yeah, two blankets. I was telling Carlos today, I said, man, Getting kids ready for winter is way harder. Like if we were just putting like a onesie on her and then putting Jackson a pair of shorts and t-shirt, we would've been out the door in 10 minutes. This took forever, because even I'm double layered, she's double layered, he's double layered. It was quite the process. Um, this is our first time using our new stroller. We opted to not have Jackson be able to go in it for today because we want him to walk around. But this piece actually that she's in is also his seat that we could like turn around and then she can sit in the car seat. But I kind of wanted her to like flat on her back instead of sitting in the car seat. So that's why we ended up doing this. And Jackson's having so much fun here. I feel like he really missed like probably me being at the park with him. Cause the whole time we've been here, we're like, mama, mama. Yeah, I've been doing this trip for myself this past few weeks. And we're officially alone too, so me and Papa left. So it's just us now, huh, Jackson? What are you doing? And he's actually staying <laughs> around us. He's not running off somewhere else. Yeah. I feel like he wants to hang out, that's why. A little Miss Snoozy over here. These boys have just been racing. They love racing right now. Jackson's such a fast runner. Let me watch this, let's see if he'll do it. Come here, give me a hug! Here he comes. Run faster, faster! Faster, 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 faster! Oh, I love you so much. You're so fast. Carlos has not been feeling that well today. Mama. We're hoping he's not getting too sick, but I am gonna try Mama. some. Mama. This is icky, you do not want this. You wanna smell it? Mama. Smell it. <laughs> <laughs> you want some? He's got, he's got the syringe ready, he wants to try it. <laughs> he wants to try it? Okay, so so this is like a, a, a little remedy, it's called fire water, okay? So it's apple cider vinegar with hot water, salt, and cayenne pepper. And Carlos has to take a tablespoon of this every 15 minutes until it's finished. It smells so bad though, here. You know what this reminds me of? What? Like a So Cassie video. Oh. Like you have to take a shot of that. No, we never liked <laughs> apple cider, <laughs> Smell it. To oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Go on, feel better. You wanna be sick? <laughs> I don't want to be sick. Nobody's allowed to be sick in here. Look at this. All right, take a tablespoon. It's probably hot. Oh, oh. Oh man. How was it? It tastes like apple cider, but the cayenne <laughs> takes away a little bit of the flavor. Oh man, that's disgusting. And I love, I love cayenne. Yeah. I'm glad the cayenne takes away a little bit of flavor from the. Vinegar. It's so funny. If I was sick, I would probably refuse to take all of this, but Carlos is like for everything. I made Carlos a flu bomb earlier too. It was like with honey, garlic, cayenne, all the goodies, garlic, you know. And he took it like a champ. I would have never done that. That actually was really good. I don't know what recipe you got, but that was delicious. I'll make that again for you it probably was later. It was spicy, but it was so good. I could drink that again. I could drink that for fun. <laughs> Hopefully you start feeling better. Wow, you put that in your pocket? Clever, very nice. <laughs> oh yeah. That's to take medicine, not to play with. You know that, right? Oh, hey, where'd you get that? Oh my gosh, you almost broke it. This is for the snot sucker. You wanna try it? No, I'm not trying it. So today has been kind of more of a chill day for us. Um, Carl, with Carlos not feeling that great, we're just kind of hunkering down at the house, obviously. But this morning, Kyra, Iris, Iris actually had her first ever chiropractor appointment, which we did for Jackson. Um, we also had a lactation consultant uh, come over. Not that I had like huge concerns, but I did want to make sure that she didn't have any kind of oral ties or anything like that since Jackson had like really severe ones. She does not have oral ties, but we did take it to the chiropractor just to help with some of the digestion problems that she's been having. Overall, she's been really great, but the past week with her has definitely been different than like the first couple weeks. First couple weeks, the girl just slept forever. 
Um, and I feel like the past week or so, she's definitely been having like some pretty bad tummy problems. And so I wanted to take her to the chiropractor because I feel like she really wants to sleep and she can't because of tummy stuff. So we took her to the chiropractor and she's been taking such a great nap since we got home actually. And she's been super happy. I have no idea if the chiropractor is actually gonna help, but we take her because it worked for Jackson. She's been taking a really good nap. This girl likes to sleep, it's pretty crazy. Uh, at night we struggle, but uh, overall she's pretty good during the day. Just at night we've been struggling a little bit more. With oh my goodness, are you holding your sister? Me? What kind of, she's sitting with you? My baby. <laughs> Is she going night night? Oh, she's kind of awake. She's, she's getting, ooh, she's, she's mad at you. She's eyeballing you. Ooh, what'd you do to her? What's she saying yeah, to you? Baby. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah? The baby. The baby. The baby. The baby. Yeah, there she is. Are you gonna feed her? You got you got any milk in there? Hey, baby. <laughs> Not have milk in there. Mommy has milk. Baby? <laughs> yeah, you can put her in the swing later, huh? Oh, you're such a good big brother. That's her ears, yeah? And her other ear? And her nose, her mm. lips, mm. her eye. Gentle with her eyes, please. Mm. Mama? Yeah? Mm. That her eye? Mm. Yep. Mm. Her ears, yep. Mm. And her hand mm. her lips. Oh, ah. and she's punching you. <laughs> Just you wait. I'm sure she'll give you a beating someday. <laughs> she's going to grow into these muscles eventually. Mm. Just a little one. Come here. Bam. Ah. <laughs> He loves it. You're so cute. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> She'll be punching you in no time, I'm sure. <laughs> Bless you. All right, we got our before bed shenanigans. Here we go. Oh, he's so silly. <laughs> uh, I don't think you're going to fit like this no more. Um, he can fit. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Iris is sitting over here hanging out in her mama room, being a good baby. Oh, while her brother, while her brother monkeys around until bedtime, huh? Go. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Let's <laughs> wait to use your head. Uh oh. There we go. I trapped him. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Hey. You. That is so silly. So we just got Jackson to bed, which means we need to do our favorite thing ever. Open up Pokemon cards. <laughs> Open up Pokemon cards while he's sleeping. I'm super excited because Pokemon actually sent this to us, and I'm gonna let Carlos tell you what we got. They sent us a new set. There's the new set coming out next. There's the Scarlet Violet Paldean Fates. Ooh. They sent us a booster bundle, a tin. This and the Elite Trainer box. Now this is the coolest box ever. I'm excited for this one because we do get a, a promo card. What do we get from it? Mimikyu. Mimikyu. What do we want from this box the All most? Right, so obviously when there's a Charizard in a, in a set, you obviously want to go for the Charizard. There's a shiny Charizard in here that I really want. Oh, I don't know if it's in here, but I hope there is <laughs> one. But there's a shiny Charizard in this new set that I really want and also a Pikachu. All right. So I'm going to see if I can try to pull it in in this little bundle right here. Again, I just want to say thank you to Pokemon for sending this to us. We really appreciate it because my husband's a little Pokemon little fanatic, okay? It's like his like his one thing he really likes, okay? It's Pokemon. <laughs> Leave in the comments who's going to get the better card. We're getting nine booster packs though. Carlos already, I think, got a better card than me. All Did right. you peek? No, I didn't peek. I don't know what it is yet. <laughs> but I'm, I'm probably going to go right now. I can see something. Adapters. I can see something dark right there. Something shiny back there. What? Ah. That's so cool though. Not I what like... I wanted though. But it's but... cool. Alright, Carlos thinks he got a really good one here. Let's see if he's right. Our baby's getting mad, so you better hurry. <laughs> Alright, let me know. Let it be a shiny. Come on. We're looking for a shiny Charizard or a shiny Pikachu. Da -da -da -da. I don't know what that is. No? It's not even a shiny, man. <laughs> I didn't get the Pikachu, but I did get the right shoe. I got that. Or Cassie got the right shoe. <laughs> Cassie got the right shoe. No, but you can keep it, though. You can keep it. <laughs> <laughs> so these are the hits. We got right shoe. That one's really cool. 
<laughs> these are all the shiny ones, I think. Yeah. I got two of these. What? Shiny Prime Ape. Nice. Ooh, I like that one too. Yeah, this is pretty much all I got. That's cool. All right, so I wanted to weigh Iris before we go to bed. She's actually in like a fresh diaper. And yes, we know these diapers are way too big, okay? We were, <laughs> we were just doing an experiment. These are the bamboo diapers I want her to eventually wear, but that, you know, she doesn't fit in them yet. So it's fine, she won't be wearing them again. But we're gonna weigh her. What's your guess, Carlos? Eight pounds. Eight pounds? <laughs> My guess is that she's gonna be Jackson's birth weight, okay? So she's her brother's birth weight. Seven pounds, 15 ounces, okay? Here we go, let's see. I know, just one second and, and go. Seven point Wait. Nine. Oh, what? She lost weight. <laughs> it said seven nine. All right, she's seven point eight nine. I thought that she'd be more. Okay, so her lactation consultant weighed her, and she was seven thirteen, but she had clothes and a diaper on. So I guess it did make all the difference. A seven eight seven nine, not bad. Well, anyways, guys, I think this little girl is ready for bed. She's literally been waiting for us to like finish all our little shenanigans so she can go night night. So we're gonna go and end today's video. If you guys liked it, if you did, smash that thumbs up button, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye guys, say bye!